Welcome back to the second part of uh, the Kursk scenario in uh, Panzer Corps II Grand Campaign. And we, um, it's been bloody, uh, prestige about even. We've made a couple of uh, surrenders on some 43s, believe it or not, from the auxiliary units up here. But um, it's been bloody, bloody surely. We were about to uh, try and dispatch... Um, so we move five, and that's uh, one... Let's see, uh, you should only move, I, I think, a half track, I see. Forest is two, so that's one, two, and then we can bounce off there once we do away with you. And you. And then, um, hmm. How about you? Six, four, uh, seven, two. A strat bomb should do this guy wonders here, really. So, um, yeah, that's a bloodbath turned into uh, not so much so, and we can move our uh, recon vehicle here, and, um, hmm, let's see if, um, we're in no hurry to advance, in fact, um, we need to deal with this guy. And we can go like that, like that, like that as well. So this guy cannot uh, pass through these zones of control, meaning our um, anti-tank here, or anti-air is safe. Uh, but uh, as for him doing much, serving any purpose, he doesn't seem to be doing so presently. We'll probably get bombed here. What can we do about it? I don't think there is anything that we can do about it. Let's see what... Um, we may as well uh, do four points there. What are you? Uh, 42 and so 43 will do that. We can overrun him or... Um, let's just overrun him. What do you have? Um, that's a 3 4 there. 1 8, 1 9, 1 10. That's, um, I think we can put it to this guy here. Um, let's go like that. Ten points. Uh, we can uh, strat bomb this guy into uh, hopefully oblivion. How about you? There's a nine points there. Ten points there. And you. I see. There's a tenor. We'll continue to advance here, leveraging our air. So we have uh, exactly one round left. I think uh, we're happy. Okay, dokey, we can go. Um, hmm. We can go here and there. Something could come screaming and take our flank. I was going to put this there, but I think we can put our 15 camouflaged here and hopefully get some action off of it uh, while also overrunning this guy, hopefully, um, once we get uh, some... We can juice him here, so one point there, we'll go like that. Two points, uh, one point, um, I think two points, and maybe this guy can go over and heal. I think he can move forward and then heal fully up. We can uh, move here. This is a vigilant tank, so 
And then you uh, can go up here. And hopefully those tanks will bite on our recon vehicle there. And um, put some hurt into themselves. We'll go right here and um, we'll go over here as well. Let's see. Um, we can de entrench this guy. I'm not really sure there's a point in it. Uh, our pioneer should be able well, or our flame tank will do him. This, this uh, tank has no ability to deal with entrenched or close terrain. So um, where do we have a lack of air cover? We can do one point or we can just go right here and do a double coverage on these, these uh, air assets there. Okay, let's see what goes on um, about this area. Uh, we're going to try to clear that. And, um, hmm. We can go there for 2-2. Two, two. Uh, I see. What we did is just opened up another attack vector for this guy. Well, wow. Can we move forward? Uh, we can't. Uh, we can do... Um, I think we're happy here. There's no rush. I don't want to get myself in any trouble. Okay, so... Um, how much here? Uh, 200 prestige. Um, hmm. We're going to need to down some of these planes here. Um, like sooner than later. How about you, this yak? We need to get that yak down. So that's a zero two, and that's a zero one. We'll go with a zero two. That's four points. I think we have one point. I see. Two points. I see. Two points, I see. All right, and you, uh, two points there as well. One point. I see him, I see him. Hmm. And you? No points, no points. I can't believe what I'm seeing there. It's uh, zero points. We can't damage this thing? What is that thing again? That's that's uh, air attack. I see air attack fifteen. So Yak nine D. That's 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 our problem. That and the the lower stars, which is two star here. So one point. All right, I believe it now. So we'll take the two points here. Suppose we'll take the two points here, and we'll go up here and try to put some damage in this uh, contraption there. As long as our fighters are here, we may as well um, put some pain in that thing, what there is of it. Uh, these guys, um, well, we're going to fly off in the other direction here as our fighters are busy elsewhere. We don't want to be uh, attacked. So... We got one fighter off the board, <clears throat> relatively painlessly, I suppose. Uh, looks as though somebody did something here. Who are you? Um, I see, him, I see. Him. One point. This guy's down to six. We need this guy to um, major. Stankovsky. What is the story, Major Stankovsky, here? Looks as though he just has a 15 over strength uh, artillery piece there. Hmm. And you as a 2 4 there, because of probably because of Major Stankovsky. I would imagine he has artillery support as well. He does, um, 
Let's see, uh, 21 worth. All right. This fellow does not seem to have any support, really. Uh, we're taking one point, unfortunately. Uh, it's a 4-2 there. There's another um, less potent version there, the mobile artillery. It's a Nashorn. You do not want to get this thing anywhere near the front unless, unless you do, which apparently we may. I suppose we could try to capture this thing and maintain a semblance of uh, defense. How can we do it though? How can we do it? We would have to move forward um, Grenadier and a Ware. So if we go like that, we can go here. And then we go there. And we move our Nash Horn here. Supports either of these against tank. It leaves this completely exposed to the uh, machinations of this um, recon vehicle there. But we'll, we'll get to that uh, at some point, perhaps. We can uh, probably extract a fair bit of prestige off of this contraption if we're only able, I see, to get some suppression on it as opposed to... Um, I see. Hmm. Hmm. How much here? Uh, 134 there, I see. And then we'll just take another round from a major, um, major pain there. So perhaps we'll go over in this direction and retreat. And as I don't think that major pain can get around the other side there. And um, it looks as though a decent plan is coming about. We'll have to. Do we have any anti-tank that? Now look at that, we can move here. Uh, seems to have, a plan seems to be coming about here. If we go like that. We can then go um, and heal you up. And go like that. How about you? There's an H tank, we can go like that. There's another H tank here, go like that. So what do we have here now? No suppression, no bombers, nothing. Uh, we'll, we'll heal you up just because we do that sort of thing. We, we like that idea. Apparently we're going to head down here, hopefully. We'll leave our perch in the, the close terrain there and be happy here. This guy can still make it around there, perhaps. Yeah. How about you? Hmm. Yeah, we'll go um we'll go down here for what it's worth. So again, um it would be nice to have a suppression point on this guy, but I don't see where it's gonna come from. We have a zero four, uh one two one two, maybe you one one a 1-1. One, one. Hmm. Then a 2-4. We'll take a 0-4 there, that means. Let's see what happens here. We have no suppression. Zero suppression, I see. So, and that should do it. We'll take what we can get. We got something. These guys uh, theoretically are supported, at least everyone but him. We'll pop off there. This is an H tank. 20, 21, and 20, I think. Something like that. So, um, uh, we have, um, you are an anti-tank. Hmm. And where is our infantry? Is here. I see, I see. There's a wear infantry right there. Probably fair, um, really better than not against this contraption right here. If we just um, let go and 
let him do his thing. We'll send him down over this way. We can't force march? Apparently not, no. How about you? We can. We cannot, though, no. We'll turn into uh, organic transfer. Oh, well. <sighs> Unfortunately, that did not work out as a pole, uh, according to plan. But um, it can, it can. We just need to be a bit more patient. How about you? 2 4, 2 2, 7 0. There's major pain right there, yeah. We need to open up a slot here so that um, we can get our infantry at uh, this HW infantry here and um, get at major pain. I see, 14 and what? 0, 0. So. That this is not working out well at all there now. Why is this? Oh, it's Major Payne. He's just backing him up, yeah. All right, well. We're going to heal you up and... 5-1. There's Major Payne again right there. He even protects this minefield. Hmm. See. 7-0, 2-3, 2-4. And we'll go right here. Maybe that infantry will damage itself. I would wager that's... Um, it's possible, if not plausible. Why did we move him there and not um, not you? It's not exactly um, clear. We move a grenadier down as well. Why not do it? Because we need to heal the grenadier. That's what we'll do. This guy is good there. Some four three. Um, they go there. To what end, really? Um, maybe the enemy will damage himself. What's his heart attack there? 22, I say. Hmm. Well, we'll go here. Let's see what's down there, if nothing else. Exert a zone of control in this area. We'll get um, this pioneer down in this area here. Um, then there's major pain there again as well, this fellow. Go we'll back up... Uh, that guy, anybody around there. There's no close terrain about at all, really. Hmm. Pioneer has organic transports, probably very expensive. I don't think we need that Pioneer down here. We're going to send him up in this area. And, um, let's see, we can do that. Uh, four points there, four there. We'll take that three points there, move forward here. Advance there as well. We seem to have found ourselves a bunker as well. Um, okay, so this guy seems to have already moved and attacked. We're good there, happy. Uh, you, um, um, He's backed up by anti-tank. Um, we're probably going to take another bloodbath uh, with the enemy's uh, air force. Uh, what's the point of going um, forward here? I think there there may be a point we could heal here with this M tank, but um, I wonder if we get here um, whether we could get around the back of this K. Uh, KY-42, and then at some point surrenderize him. Rather than just uh, mulling about here, let's do it. So you, uh, there's a 07. Let's do it.
I think uh, these guys have moved out. This guy is happy there, unless there's something I didn't see. There's not. Uh, we're good there. That Tiger 1 can take care of himself, un unless uh, there's something else. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, 1, 2. Um, looks like he has four rounds left. If, if only we had... Um, I will go back here. <clears throat> you know, five, three, we're good. Um, we're happy there as well. We're good there. Happy. I think we can heal there. One six, one six. Um, we'd have to pay, but it could be worth it. Nah, it's not. We're good there. And we want to um, leave this painful area here and then perhaps so we can uh, proceed in this direction. Away from major pain. Off here we go. Um, I think this guy was going to stay there. We're happy enough to do that. Uh, we'll take some air fire there as well, I think. Uh, next turn. I think we're going to pivot our Air Force up to this northern front. I think it's done its uh, duty down here, and it's needed up uh, to the north. saying something about moving to the north but there seem to be uh, quite a few planes about this area still as well Tank killer 21 centimeter or a 15 centimeter five star. I think those guys are going to be overrun. I'm not sure they're capturable, but who knows? Who knows? Uh -oh. No ammo. Let's leave this uh, until we figure out what's going on here. Ten, ten. That's a really ugly. Uh, hmm. Well, we'll go up here. Eight, uh, four, uh, seven, two. Okay. Um, Tactical bomber, fighter. There's one of those ill contraptions there. That's five of five there, but I think you can go. Uh, let's see what happens here. Five of five. We just overrun this lot. This one does not have Vigilant. It has two rounds left. Let's see what we have here. Um, one, four, um, 43 tank, 43, uh, 70. Hmm. 
And if there were a way to um, pulverize this guy from our, with our artillery, I think there is actually. We can go like that. We can go up here. Forego healing. Move forward here. And then uh, see about putting it to this guy. So six uh, with uh, minimum entrenchment. We need three points on him and he will surrender. Let's do that from here. We'll uh, heal up there. And um, let's see, let's see what we'll do. So these guys, uh, theoretically this camouflaged artillery will protect this lot here from any attack. If these planes um, can be done away with. that um, let's see we go like that we can do that we can go up here three points uh, so this LA5 is actionable surely we can put him away it's five points here, right? Um, six, I see. Six points. We need six. We have five. Five, five. Uh, hmm. There's five there as well. Bam. I suppose five points it is. Can go there. Zero, eight. How about you? One nine, one nine, uh, zero eight. Um, we'll go here, um, there. One eight, uh, zero eight. Those guys are done. So we can um, invite the enemy to attack us here. We don't. Um, wonder if we were to uh, rebase, if we could make it that far. It doesn't look like we can. We'd have to go here. Well, let's do it. We'll go there and then uh, rebase up here the turn after. We'll probably go there at some point, but we're not there. Alright, uh, let's see here. Was, uh, actually, it's not really that bad. Uh, 210. Um, I, I see, I see. Hmm. We just sent. Well, hmm, hmm. hmm. This Ware Infantryman um, probably not going very far, very fast. Let's get him moving in the right direction at least. We can get him here. We'd want to have him maybe st hold down this area at some point and just sort of let him be there. We'll just uh, have him be because he doesn't have an organic transport. It's cheap. Uh, let's see here. We have him. Um... Hmm. And why we're trying to open up a hole in these. Um... Formations exactly. Um, I'm not entirely clear on that. Uh, we could damage ourselves here against these um, uh, conscripts. Looks as though we have done it. Um, as to why we want to do it, it seems to be a thing. All right, well, we are doing it. As to whether there's a greater point to it, don't ask me. I think we can do away with that. 
and that. That. We'll come up there as well, open up the hole there just because. And I think um, we're good there. And then there's there's this mess here. We were trying to, th we had some grand idea about getting around the back of one of these units. I think it was um, that guy. Ah, did I, well, there's Major Payne there. He has his friend here, Minor Payne, I suppose. I suppose this... Uh, I see, I see. Hmm. Alright, and... Um, yeah, maybe we can get around the back of that guy. I don't see why not. We have a recon vehicle. We have um. We have you. We have you. And we have you. And we have this armor here, which I'm assuming, with all this anti-tank about, we're going to be able to stop and form a cohesive line there. But I have given it exactly zero thought. But I, we have so many anti-tank about. You have to assume that we can do it. Along those lines, let's see if we can put some pain into, um, let's see, a LA-5, Yak-7, a Strat Bomber, and one of these things alone and by itself. 8, 12, and 12, yeah. The IL-2M-2. I wonder if we were to go like that. like that what would happen I think this ill becomes ill and crashes out is what happened there yeah. so we also then can stukize this thing or you even better yet now this contraption here the SO122 uh, Artillery support only. So if we were to come here, we would do, uh, we would take three points from what? From this thing being an anti-tank weapon. Hmm. Yeah, you, um, 03, 04, 05, 05. Hmm. Theoretically, we'd want to heal you. And uh, we have one point there, I see, I see. That did not work out nearly as well as one might have hoped. Unfortunately. Although this minefield perhaps um, could be cleared. And this ware can come back. We'll finish the job here. And then you can come here. I was saying something about so many anti-tank about. Um, Three points, I see, I see. Hmm. So if you come here, that's not close, it's not. Um, we can take out that um, minor pain right there. And then, uh, and there's still major pain here. We can apply some suppression. Six points there. And you, um. Hmm. Well, let's do it. Let's do that. We'll just apply some suppression. 
I think we can come uh, here and apply a couple of more suppression points. What does that mean for us now? It's a four of eight. That uh, means we need three points on them. There's two points and then um, two points, two points, I see. Well, we, um, we can go like this. And bring this fellow forward here. Put one more point on him. Means we only need two points, which we have here. We'll grab some prestige on his dime. The problem is he, um, the support mechanism now is sort of broke down. I wonder if we could capture this guy as well. I'm fairly certain um, it can be done. We have a pioneer here. That pioneer may get done. Something could come screaming out of that area, but um, who knows? Let's see. Uh, five of nine, four. We need three points. We have it right there. We can go uh, forward here. We'll take some prestige there as well. Let's get that guy off the board. Then there's these guys who are um, taking a horrendous amount of damage from our elephant, at least against this unit. Uh, you, however, have no uh, hard support at all, but you are um, an H-tank and theoretically able to take care of yourself. Also have a full movement left. And we can establish that line that I was thinking on. We'll go right there. So, this unit, uh, this anti-tank elephant that came and dispatched minor pain is taking this guy's place. We can move him over um, In this, how much uh, damage there? One, two there. Why not do it? We'll go there. This guy can make it um, here, so. I see some. We'll go, um, we'll go right there. Swing that unit back over here. And uh, note that our Tiger tank has no support, but. Um, Major pain is the only way I see. I see. <laughs> well, luckily we have uh, acquired the um, prestige necessary to heal ourselves up um, from the um, capture activity we've done here. And Major pain is welcome to um, bombard us at his leisure. We use his own uh, parts and whatnot to thwart his effort. So, um, I think that's coming up on the uh, end of the turn here. This guy has moved. Um, let's see. Um, we will go forward here. There. Nine points, I see. I see. What if we go like that? Nine points, I see. So theoretically, this uh, unit is camouflaged, the anti-tank. So if we go like that, uh, maybe these guys uh, self-implode and we'll mop them up afterward. Something, um, this anti-tank, something would have to go quite some ways down here and sort of stumble onto this. We're assuming that's, let's assume that's not going to happen. Um... And you, um, mountain infantry, eight of ten entrenched. And, hmm. and you, a pioneer. Yeah, we'll go right here. What in the heck is going on here? In fact, the matter, I, uh, I don't really have a cohesive plan for these uh, units. Even if we were to engage make it through the second line of mines. I mean, 
what do what have we earned the ability to do really just uh, attack these conscripts and on the fortifications backed up by bunkers and take a bunch of damage let's 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 redeploy and get get out of this area it's, it's a bad idea these guys on the other hand uh, well there doesn't seem to be any uh, any way this this area will be take us the rest of the game to get through this area is sort of backward um, hmm uh, maybe we'll carry on in this in this direction here with these guys and see about taking some damage this where infantryman here seems relatively inexpensive this grenadier um, We'll move them here as well. These guys have no organic transport, so they're not going anywhere really quickly. And you, uh, is there any reason why we should go, um, say, up there instead of down here? Um, uh, not really. Uh, other than we are here, and there's a minefield there, and what can we do down here we can fill a space here uh, adjacent to an anti-tank and do some capture I think that's what we'll do um, we'll maybe get down here so we can engage in or help with some of that why not so this guy let's see here is a 6-0 that's because of major pain there there's no support here at all this guy can't he can get there for one six if he goes there well, I say bring it on bring it on one nine one nine one nine how about you heal up there uh, we're happy there theoretically at least we we'll become encircled and then um, I think we're happy there as well. Z him out. Um, heal up or not. Uh, I see. So, um. That's, um hmm. What's going to cost the enemy the most? Is what I would imagine. It's probably you. Yep. We'll go right here. Yak 7. Law 5, I think the Yak 7. Let's see. Um, limited range we'll get um, down here. Z him out. Will not do that. Um, I think that's it for the turn. Uh, next turn. Pain has shifted the focus there. That worked out exceptionally well due to our double camouflage, and it keeps working. We're going to run out of ammo mopping these guys up. Holy moly!
I'm surprised uh, that uh, Flame Panzer didn't retreat, but apparently he didn't. That's five strength left. Looks like we're about 45 minutes in uh, to the uh, second episode of this, and um, this will probably be quite long. Um, so let's uh, assess what we've got. Um, we'll do away. Well, we'll just start this uh, in the next episode, and I hope to see you then.